Saggies, uh, it is your personal relationship reading for January 2021. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win for reading hypnosis or whatever I do. Also visit EnchantedSky.com. You can book a reading with me. And remember that I don't use cards because I don't need them when I do a reading. So, and if you do, you know, I've had a couple people that have recently saying, you know, I give away a lot. This is all free to you. This YouTube channel is free to you. Um, I do charge for my readings. It is an exchange of energy. And just that you understand that you shouldn't be going constantly to people for free readings. I know a lot of people are, I've been on TikToks, things like that. And I want you to understand you're creating karmic debt. Okay, I'm not saying to, to get paid a billion dollars and I'm not saying that even have to get paid some type of exchange. I know when people are need a reading, they need some solace that I offer a reading for them. If they tell me a joke or donate 20 bucks to the Alzheimer's Association. I mean, I have people do that a lot. So just to let you guys know, please don't create a lot of karmic debt for people. Okay, just thought it would... Because that was just a subject on my podcast recently. So with that said, visit my podcast, Metaphysical Meanderings. That is my podcast. That um, It's on 216thenet.com, on here on YouTube, uh, uh, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, you name it, it's there. All right, so let's get on with this. Joke of the day. Why did the nut get sick and tired of chasing you? Because he knows he can't cash you. <laughs> so there you go. I know they're stale. But you know, they're clean. Just remember that. Okay. Ooh, we got a sun and a meeting with somebody. Something's going our way. Ooh, there's an opposite job opportunity. There, there's, there's a meeting with... Ooh, okay. See, look at... Mm, this is a very meditative thing. We've got... The tower card down here, which is a very interesting. Now, I'm going to tell you something. When I see the tower card with the sun, I know that this is not a bad thing. Now, there is a meeting with some people and this 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 month, and it has to do with something to do with a job because you're headed that way. A new career, a new way of making money, something. And there is a meeting. The meeting has to do with a queen of swords and there's a king of swords. So in the past, there may have been another person of power. Maybe you left one job, went to another, something like that. But this queen of swords, when, when king and queen of swords are one position away from me, there's a twin flame type of energy going on. Very, very powerful. This person is supposed to be in your life. Okay. Now, you know... You're doing a lot of soul searching, a lot of downtime, a lot of healing. And are you stuck? This can rock the upside down hermit can represent you feeling stuck and maybe having to go forward and being forced to, and you really don't want to. And it's almost like you're kicking and screaming. But there's an ending. And it's always the darkest before the dawn. It's gonna get better because you know, you're walking away from what does not work. Now, I'm gonna pull a couple of clarifiers here. Yeah, you have a decision to make and you don't know which way to go. You know, you're kind of like, okay, which what what am I doing here? What am I, you know, I'm making plans. You know what I'm saying? You're trying to make your plans. What What's your next move? And you're on your way to being okay on victory. Because there is, during this month, a message and a creative message coming. This person brings a creative message to you that helps you solve your problems. Now, you won the battle, but not the war. And what? And you're kind of going, okay, what was this all for? Okay. And there's a walking away about it too. So somebody's going somewhere is going, you know what, I'm done. You win, I'm done. And somebody, I just, I really think there's also, there's a couple of people, there's a queen of swords that's involved, but this, this king of pentacles, I don't feel like it's you. I feel like somebody else is involved. That's, let's see what we get. Oh, you're getting your wish. Is somebody, is it somebody with money involved to help you? Because there is something from, this person could be from your past or this situation is coming from your past, Sag. 
I hope this is my reading because, man, I could use this. And I keep getting told that there's a man coming into my life that's going to be very helpful. So I'm wondering, too, that I'm kind of like, as I'm reading this, I can't read for myself. I'm too emotional. But I do see that much. Do you know what I'm saying? Anyway, um, I want to say it's a wish granted out of the clear blue, and it's a shock. See how I'm saying that this card is not always bad? Okay. You know, pull it. yeah, it's going to happen very, quick, very, very quickly. Very, very quickly. Look at that. In January. So, I feel like in your recent past, this might have been a boss or a judge, something, somebody of power that maybe you're getting rid of and you're going forward to meet one of these two people. And it might be both, but there is a relationship going on that's equal, it's blessed, it's, it could be a doctor even, it, you know, or somebody that, that's, a, a, that's well knowledgeable. I feel like this person might be the, an ending too, but they might be involved somehow. I just feel like this person's important. This is an important person. Now, this could be a Taurus, a Capricorn, or a Virgo. But I feel like this person must have money because it is a wish granted. And maybe they're going to back you somehow financially or give you a job. But there is some type of opportunity coming out of the relationship, out of the personal relationship. Okay. So to sum this all up, you've got a tower card, but it's not a bad tower card. You've got the sun sitting here. So... You're going to get a wish, but it's going to be something that's pleasantly shocking. You're like, out of the clear blue, okay? And remember, I'm a Sag myself, so I'm kind of going, okay, what is this? You know, I mean, I, and it's something from your past. So it's past, past person or past skill. It's something you already, someone or something you already know about, okay? Now, this is a very healing time, very, very healing time for you. Take a little downtime. Because you need it. Because here it comes. And it's going to come quickly. So my my prediction is that you're going to be very busy after January. Okay. Um, you're making plans. And you're on your way. Please look at You've got the happy family also. The happily ever after. Combined with a, with a nine of cups is your wish. So... Whatever your wish is, it's being granted. Blessings to all of you guys. I will be coming back with your um, February. Tell me what's going on because I want to hear what people are going on for Saggies. I'll let you guys know. You guys always hear anyway. <laughs> Blessings.